Hi guys, welcome back to Petrochem Tech. This video is intended to provide the first hand knowledge about the hazard information system as implemented in India. This is useful for the following target groups drivers, traffic police, industries, transporters, emergency managers, firefighters. The classification of chemical hazards as recommended by the UN Committee of Experts. Class 1. Explosives. Consider of six divisions. An explosive, or explosive material, is a reactive substance that contains a great amount of potential energy that can produce an explosion. If released suddenly, usually accompanied by the production of light, heat, sound, and pressure. Class 2. Gases. Consider of three divisions. Gases are mostly carried under pressure to reduce their volume and hence to save space in transport and storage. Class 3. Flammable liquids. Consider of three divisions. A flammable liquid is a combustible liquid which can be easily ignited in air at ambient temperatures that is, it has a flash point at or below nominal threshold temperatures. Class 4. Flammable solids. Of three division, flammable solids are any materials in the solid phase of matter that can readily undergo combustion in the presence of a source of ignition under standard circumstances. Class 5. Oxidizers. An organic peroxide of two divisions. An oxidizer is a chemical that readily yields oxygen in reactions, thereby causing or enhancing combustion. Class 6. Poisonous and etiologic. Of three divisions, poisonous material is a material other than a gas known to be so toxic to humans that it presents a health hazard during transportation. Class 7. Radioactive materials. Class 8. Corrosives. Class 9. Miscellaneous. Hazardous material. The pictogram. The basic principle however, is that the shape, color, and pictogram convey a clear message of danger, thus overcomes language difficulties. Till some time, back firemen had no way of knowing what medium of extinguishment on unknown chemicals in a fire, spillage, or any emergency should be used. 
incorrect actions resulted in disasters. Availability of information on the hazardous nature of substance and required control measure helps the emergency management personnel to take quick and correct decisions. The Hazechem Code, also called Emergency Action Code, gives vital information to fire brigade and other emergency services on the action to be taken. The Hazechem Code consists of a numbers from 1 to 4 and any one of the letters P, R, S, T, W, X, Y, Z followed at times by the letter E. The letters signify four aspects. I, method of controlling spillage. A, by diluting or B, by containing. 2, personal protective equipment to be worn by firefighters. 3, reactive nature of chemical. 4, need for evacuation. The fire services personnel should carry the Hayes Gym Code scale and notes for guidance. Hayes Gym Code of some important and popular chemicals transported on Indian roads are given. For motor spirit, with UN number 1203, the Hayes Gym Code is 3Y E, and this would mean 3 use of foam only. Y can be violently, V, reactive or explosive. Breathing apparatus plus protective gloves to be used in case of fire. The personal protective equipment is not a requirement in case of spillage. Any spillage of the substance should be contained. E consider evacuation as a first priority. In India, it is mandatory for the vehicles transporting hazardous chemicals to display emergency information panel EIP with details and at places as specified we can have a happy life like this instead of being like that in this busy world don't forget to like comment and share think about it Plant more trees and recycle.